Synesthesia is a phenomenon that happens in the human brain where uh, the physical connections between some of the neurons actually intertwine. So some people might taste color or listen to music and see color or, or you know, other different phenomena that can happen from that. This project aims to capture that whole experience in a more direct but also abstract way. But there's another component besides the, just the definition of synesthesia, is the idea of uh, part of our research is mainly how bodies or humans or basically living organisms relate to machinic. And synesthesia is almost like in the middle, connecting those two. So here at Jefferson, I had the opportunity to create my own custom minor, uh, which includes courses in both architecture and in industrial design. And as I was putting together the classes that I wanted to formulate this minor, I stumbled upon synesthesia as a course. And this seemed like the perfect class to, you know, really get my hands dirty in prototyping and fabrication. The project was already there conceptually, and then uh, the idea of the course came in as, as a way to offer to the students an experience of a design-build project. We were very excited because we were able to run the course and open the course to many different departments. Nexus Learning at Jefferson is our active, collaborative, um, interdisciplinary learning to solve complex problems. And a really good example of this is our synesthesia project that brought together students from the architecture, interior design, industrial design, fashion, textile, engineering, and other disciplines to create this wonderful sculpture. Interdisciplinary learning is really helpful because you get to be exposed to different types of things that you normally wouldn't be. So when you can talk to people in the workplace or professionals, um, you really have a better understanding of being able to have a conversation with them. Everybody has been extremely helpful and friendly. Um, Abby especially, she's the one that I've been having the most contact with. My role in the project is to translate the creative and artistic vision that Lucia, Severino and Jefferson have into a functional being through engineering and technology. I'm most impressed with the multidisciplinary talent of the students and you know the, the faculty as well. My education at Jefferson has been very well rounded and this project was very unexpected for me. Um, and I honestly thought I would just be doing residential home interior design and now I'm working on this technological you know human reaction to machinery project so there's just been a wide opportunity that I got to receive here at Jefferson. The most interesting thing about collaboration in general but with students even more is like, like you know their interest in questioning things you know they have interrogatory aspects to anything it's like oh what about this what about that they they, they really throw ideas and they say, oh, that's interesting. I never thought of that, I never thought of that. There's a level of freshness, let's put it that way. You don't need to get stuck into how we're going to make this happen, but you just need a big idea.